One last thing. I need to get Dad's tools so I can fix that truck. Dad's toolbox should be in the garage downstairs. Here goes. What are the chances I can avoid mom or David? <laughs> I'm flipping them over. <laughs> Not yet, I told you. Three minutes each side. They're gonna burn. Oh, you're the expert now. I can't stand it. I'm telling you, it'll make a mess. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you don't have to make me breakfast. I'd settle for flowers. You cook all the time. I want you to have a break at home. <laughs> You are one class act, David Madsen. <laughs> Mom actually looks pretty happy right now. Hey, who's there? Hey, Chloe, your hair. When did you, 
Was this for the play? I heard you performed last night. Nope. I mean, I, I did, but this is, uh, is something different. None of that matters now. Oh, I am so glad to see you. Good to see you, Chloe. Coming home was a smart decision. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Thank you, sweetheart. I... Uh, I didn't get you anything. Having you back home is present enough. I'm just here to pick up something. Then I, uh, I have to go. Are you coming home tonight? Mom, I, I don't know. I wish you would tell me what you're up to. I'm, I'm just hanging out with Rachel. Oh. How is Rachel? I was telling David about the play and you being in it. I really gotta go. Listen, wait. Before you go... David has something to say to you. It won't take but a minute. Mom. I don't think this is the best idea. You already promised. <sighs> Chloe, I've made an agreement with your mother to trust you from now on. <laughs> really? What does that mean? <sighs> it means that from today forward, I'm going to take you at your word. So if you say you haven't been smoking or drinking, then I'll just leave you be. Even though she had pot yesterday. David, the idea is you should feel comfortable here, Chloe. David's not going to question you, and neither am I. David's lying to your face, Mom. He searched my room. You gave up any right to privacy, when Chloe, you... I asked David to help me yesterday, and he only did what he thought was best. You knew? You knew that David went through all of my... That was before I talked to him and explained why I disagreed with that method. But, Chloe, if I'd been able to trust you in the first place... I'm done with this. Chloe, stop. I know why you're acting this way. And I know you're gonna regret it. Come here. Take a look at this. This is my friend Phil Becker. We served in the same unit. Two tours. Becker was killed near the end of our deployment. Roadside IED. We used to joke about all the trouble we were gonna get into once we got back home. But he died. He died and I didn't. And I think about that fact every damn day. The point is, I've had my share of grief. I know what you're going through. So I guess what I'm saying is, I'm here to do what, whatever I can 
to help you get over the loss of your dad. Please, I'm begging you. Give David a chance, won't you? Here. Why don't you keep this photo for a little while? Uh, think about what I've said. David looks so young. And this Phil guy, they look close. Thank you, David. Oh, Chloe. Mom. I'm just so proud of you both. Mom, I really need to go. Be careful out there, Chloe. I love you, sweetheart. All right, all right. What the hell? Gotta grab Dad's toolbox and then get out of here quick. Holy crap. This might actually be helpful for fixing up the truck. with me here. a bit more love. I can salvage this beast. It's not like I need a manual. Not like I need a manual, but I'm really glad it's here. I bet Dad would have liked the idea. 